are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Monday, the 11th of January. I'm James Spann. Parts of the state getting snow this morning. Much of the state getting rain after today. Things quiet for a while. But a very busy day today, so let's dive in and talk about it. There's your upper trough, upper low coming in from the west, producing the inclement active winter weather today. That was a radar early this morning, and again, that gives you a good idea of where the snow is falling in the areas of blue. Uh, generally north of a line from Aliceville to near Jasper and Cullman and Guntersville. And south of that, it's mostly rain. And where the snow is falling, we've got some spots at freezing. For example, Cullman and Haleyville at 32. And there could be some patchy bridge icing, and that's the concern. So, again, if you're in an area where snow is falling in west and northwest Alabama, just understand there could be some icy spots on bridges. For the largest cities of Birmingham, Tuscaloosa, Anniston, Gadsden, and Point South, upper 30s, temps above freezing, just wet roads and wet bridges. No travel impact there. Uh, we still have the winter weather advisory for a few counties in West Alabama. Uh, that's where some light accumulation is possible. And also, this could be some light accumulation north of there as well. There's the uh, severe weather outlook. There could be some thunder near the Gulf Coast with this feature, but no severe weather expected anytime soon across the country. So here's the precipitation for the next seven days. Wettest part of the country, the Pacific Northwest down here. And this is all with the system today. Amounts under a quarter of an inch for the north, under one half inch for the south. So let's look at modeling. This is the GFS, the 06E run at 3 o'clock today. And there's your upper low coming in. Down below that, rain and snow. Let's go to the high-resolution HER model, the high-resolution rapid refresh. This is valid this morning at 10 o'clock. And again, as we've talked about, you can see the better chance of snow north of a line from near Aliceville to Jasper to Cullman up to about Scottsboro. The areas of blue south of that, rain will be falling. And in the blue area, temperatures probably sitting in the low to mid 30s, so the roads will just be wet. But like we've talked about, there could be some patchy bridge icing. This is 3 o'clock today. The precipitation winding down on the western side of the state still falling over East Alabama, and it should be over this evening. Now, this is the herd depicting the snow accumulation, and it's going to be too aggressive. As you look at these numbers, it's got some uh, three-inch amounts over northwest Alabama. There might be a spot up in there with an inch or two on the high end, but we think most places will see one-half inch or less with this today. In the grass, again, the roads will be just wet. So tomorrow it's all over. The sky will be... Uh, becoming partly sunny after some morning clouds. Highs in the upper 40s. Wednesday, sunny with mid-50s. That'll feel good. Thursday, sunny. Maybe some upper 50s. Should be the warmest day of the week. And then Friday, a cold front comes in, probably in dry fashion. Maybe a bit of scattered light rain, I guess. But uh, for the northern half of the state, it's awfully dry. And that might be a day with falling temperatures, some clouds. Uh, we start the day maybe around 50, then falling back in the 40s during the day as the cold air drops in. This is Saturday. Weather will be uh, cool and dry. We start the day below freezing. The high Saturday, probably around 50. And this is Sunday. The sky sunny. Highs, again, I'd say 45 to 50 with a reinforcing surge of colder air dropping in. And this is Monday. The flow will go zonal, but there's broad troughing over the east. And again, the weather cool and dry. So really, after today, things look quiet for a while. We'll go out 10 days. This is Wednesday of next week, the 20th. Got a trough off the Atlantic coast. And again, weather looks nice and quiet. Rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble. The mean, one to one and a half inches. Temperatures pretty close to average for January. Average values here, highs in the 50s, lows in the 30s, and we're expecting that on most days through the 21st. And the CPC outlook, this is for the 18th through the 24th, and again, showing temperatures here right at average values if this verifies. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.